Hello there, this is Finn Fournier, Benevolent Cytochorum, going to do Proverbs and Cognitive Functions. Here's Proverbs 13.2, which I thought I had done already. But anyway, we have a man shall eat good by the fruit of his mouth, but the soul of the treacherous shall eat violence. A man will get good from the fruit of his lips, but the desire of the false is for violent acts. And... Let's see, from the fruit of his lips the man enjoys good things, but the desire of the faithless is violence. You will be rewarded for saying something kind, but all some people think about is how to be cruel and mean. Which is like, welcome to the internet, good grief. <sighs> so much cruelness and meanness. So that, uh, yeah, it goes on and on like that. Anyone wants to... Let's pause and read the other ones here, and here's everyone's favorite, or least favorite, whichever ones. Man shall eat good by the fruit of his mouth, but the soul of the transgressors shall eat violence. So, all that stuff. Either way, it's sort of more a metaphorical statement than in the next verse, which lends itself even more to sounding like an INFJ. Then 13.3, which I thought I had done 13.2 before, but apparently not. But, uh, yeah, CV, yeah, some people think about is how to be cruel and mean. That, yeah. Either way, it's probably an INFJ type thing. But, uh, yeah, FE there and more an NI hero type thing. This would be perhaps parental FE still, even though it's treating others as being, like, not particularly good. But, uh, yeah, it's more a metaphorical statement and a general tendency type thing. And this is certainly true, but all some people think about is how it'd be cruel and mean. Like, uh... Yeah, growing up so many bullies, and, uh, online there's always so many barbin blocks, and, uh, all the rudeness thereof with all the downvotes, dislikes. It's nice how those in power make it convenient to be evil with the push of a button, but, uh, such joy. Either way, INFJ, probably same as the next verses, uh one there which I did before noticing that I hadn't done Proverbs 13 too. Anyway, take care everyone.